Hello there everybody, it's me from Dark Side Rock Rock to our video. Today we are back inside the hardcore survival world with Oreo. Hello Oreo, how are you doing? It's a lovely day for her, ain't it? Um, I haven't actually done that many stuff. Actually, I haven't done pretty much anything uh, after we left last time. I didn't come online here at all. Um, well, we do have sea pickles, uh, so I don't think we're gonna need that. I'm gonna keep you because of the packed ice. That might come in handy. Now we have lots of cool books. Uh, that have like stuff, a riptide, like riptide and stuff like that. We need uh, a trident, but getting a trident is kind of a long term goal for me, if you ask me. It's gonna take me quite some time. So, right now, my biggest goal is to try and find a village and to try and protect it as much as I can. And also, this thing looks absolutely horrible. We do need to add a little bit of detail around here, but that's maybe for another time. Um,. So right here, you've already seen in the previous video that there has been a few illagers, I think they're called. Uh, the bandits, I mean, they're, they're called illagers, all right? I'm not sure what they're actually called. Uh, so basically, if we kill these guys, they, um, they start a raid whenever we get um, near a village. It's like, it gives us an effect that's called like bad omen or something like that. Now, oh God. Oh god, why are you lagging me that much? Anyway, um, we need that... Um, we don't need that effect, because if I do go in a village and a raid suddenly starts, and it's not like protected by walls or anything like that, all the villagers are just gonna instantly die, because, you know, I'm not that well prepared. How did you get destroyed? I like so gently touched you. Ugh, whatever. Look at that! Ugh, thank you Minecraft, very very cool. Anyway, um, I'm not prepared to face any sort of illagers at the moment. Like uh, raids, because it's hardcore, and if I die, uh, that's it. I'm gonna have to delete the world, and I really don't want to die that soon. So, we're not gonna be killing any of these guys anytime soon. Also, what I do need to do after that is maybe make another portal, because I need some quartz, because I need to make some observers. So that I can actually um, start automating the sugarcane farm and maybe start automating this. I can't automate this without anything, it's very easy. But the sugarcane automation needs um, some observers. And that takes one quartz, two redstone, uh, six cobblestone, I think. I am not so sure about that. I cannot actually remember. But most importantly, we do need, um, we do need some, of the, uh, some quartz. Also, we have some diamonds here. Very lovely stuff. Um, Gonna try and not use this. Um, do we have an iron pickaxe? We can make one. Because I don't want to use this. I want to keep it for as much as I can. And then I'm going to enchant it and see if I can get something good out of it. Right, we're going to be planting all of these. And then after a little while, uh, I'm going to go to over... over Where is it? That side, over there. Because last time we went over that side and we explored the ocean and we got lots of loot. If you didn't watch it, go ahead and... and just Go watch it, I guess. We got lots of loot. Um, we got the horse as well. We, uh, we got Oreo in the last video. <laughs> uh, Oreo is uh, is just one of my friends. I think I did make a video about him in the channel, and I just bullied him. And when I looked at the horse, I just I just saw it. It it's like it looks like Oreos. It's like he has a little bit of white, and it's like circles. And I don't know. I just I when I looked at it, I was like, hmm, it looks like Oreos. <laughs> So I was like, yeah, sure, we'll call you Oreo. And he's a pretty fast horse, I really like him. Alright, anyway, uh, we got the food, we got this. We got a bow with mending, uh, we don't have that many arrows though. It's a little bit worrying, uh, but we don't need that many arrows, honestly. I'll put you in there. I'll grab uh, 16 coal, that's a stack. And I need to grab some wood. Alright, we just went to sleep. First thing in the morning, we're gonna uh, go ahead and start our adventure with Oreo. Are you ready, boy? Let's go. I uh, need you. Thank you very much. And we need the lead, too. Thank you very much. Now let's go over this side. And hopefully we'll find a village sometime soon. Because I need the trades. I might even make a, a villager trading, uh, like a villager breeder. Uh, I know uh, Xyzumavoid maybe made uh, something about that, like a new updated version, because there's a new way that villagers are learning stuff. 
I'm not so sure about that. Please don't disappear, thank you. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna be trying to do that. I never actually did a villager trading thing ever in my life in Minecraft. I've, I've never barely done anything in Minecraft, honestly. I've played lots uh, and lots of hours in this game, but I've never like done a trading system or anything like that. Also, apparently we're back to the spawn point. I just realized that. I have planted a few trees over here. Uh, we spawned somewhere around here. I didn't know that. No, I was just gonna keep on heading this way, I guess. Should be nice. So, today's main goal is to find a village. Ooh, a wolf! Uh, I wish if I grabbed some stuff with me. I didn't know I was gonna go through this biome. If I knew that, I would have, um, I would have got myself a few bones so that I can get myself a wolf, maybe. But I mean, um, getting a wolf while traveling is, if you ask me, a very bad idea. Because I don't want to, the wolf to die in the middle of my traveling. That would just be sad. And it frust frustrates me a lot every time a wolf dies and I'm just traveling. Alright, so horses do get injured by, by these things. That's annoying. Sheep, we don't need you. We already have a bed. More berry bushes. <gasps> yes! A swamp biome. Oh. Oh, that's good. I, I got the leads from, from the traveling merchant. Uh, that's because I couldn't find a swamp biome. I never went this way, but I finally found a swamp biome, which means I can find uh, more uh, slimes here. And I do like a little bit of redstone in my life. So, uh, sticky pistons... They need, of course, slimes, mostly. So we are gonna grab a lot of slimes here. Might make a small place for slimes to... to die in, I don't know, a grinder or something. Also, I'm pretty sure there is foxes in this game. And we can get foxes as pets. So, they spawn in these biomes. I think they're, they might be a little bit rare, or maybe they're in specific parts of that biome. So if we can get ourselves a pet horse, a pet, a pet fox, that would be lovely. I think they eat the berries. I'm finally out of the forest and into the plains biome. And back into another forest, of course. We should get up. <gasps> oh my god, look at this. It's so lovely. Oh, my favorite biome. Oh, flower forest biomes. They're just the most amazing biomes ever. Oh, I love this. Oh, it's so beautiful. I'm gonna, I'm gonna mark the coordinates for this too. There we go. The coordinates have been marked. I just absolutely love flower forest biomes. They have their own story in my heart when playing Minecraft. So I just have to maybe build a base around here somewhere. A tree house, most importantly. It has to be a tree house. For no, for no reason, honestly. I just want it to be a tree house, or maybe a house in a cave. I don't know, we'll see about that. But it's just so nice, I absolutely love this biome. So, we need at least 16 bookshelves. All of these bookshelves have uh, 3 books in them, which is 3 leather, so we're gonna need 48. Hello? Oh, there we go. So we need 48 leather, at least. Which I think I'm like... 10 away, or something like that. I'm not so sure. Ooh, is that, um, is that gonna be a savanna uh, slash desert biome right here? Oh, it is. Mm, lovely stuff. I think we can find some treasures around here. It'd be a nice, lovely temple. Also, I did buy, like, cactus from the merchant and waste lots of emeralds, and now I find this. I don't usually find deserts, probably because I barely explore in Minecraft. That's why when I look at cactus, I'm like, ooh, look, rare stuff. Or when I look at apples, I'm like, I'm like, ooh, look, rare stuff. That's why I usually keep my diamonds. I mean, my, my apples. I usually keep my apples and not eat them at all. If they weren't starter chest, because I do think di uh, the apples are very rare. I mean, let's be honest. Their drop rate is very, very low when breaking trees. 
And most of the time, you're not gonna stay in one place while breaking a tree. You're not gonna just wait until the tree just breaks and you're too lazy to break it yourself. Also, now thinking about it, this is a well that is spawns inside uh, the desert. Uh, these things are a little bit rare. If you didn't know, they are quite rare. But it's like it's like they're very useless and nobody cares about them. It's like, why would you place a well? Look at the water everywhere around here. Honestly, whoever built that well, it's like, that's the most useless thing I've ever seen. You wasted your time and your resources building that well. But wells are actually pretty rare. Uh, but it's like, they're so useless that nobody cares whether they're rare or not. It's like one of these things that are like, oh, hey, I found a well. That's, that's kind of rare. That's cool, I guess. And then you just leave it and forget about it forever. I honestly forgot that these things exist. That's, hey, okay, yeah, it's cool. We found a well. That's kind of rare. And then you just leave. <laughs> That's it. Thank you. Thank you, Minecraft. Very cool. I wish if it was a village or something even more useful, like, I don't know. I mean, a village is pretty useful at the moment, but I kind of want a desert temple. That would be kind of cool as well. Oh, wow, look, it's another well. Wow, how interesting. Very lovely. That means I'm kind of lucky, I guess. Nobody cares. I think Minecraft is just gonna tease me now. It's gonna be like, oh wow, you want a village? Here's a well. Oh wow, you want a you want a desert temple where here's a well. <laughs> well, 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 please don't unsubscribe. <gasps> a savanna village! A savannah? Is it a savannah? It is! Oh wow! Oh hello, what is this? Is it terracotta? Yeah, it is, red terracotta. Hello, sir. Uh, he doesn't want to trade with me, maybe because he doesn't trust us that well. What's inside your chest? I'll take all your items. Thank you very much, sir. Um, I am gonna slap you right here, please. Stay here, Oreo. Good boy. Thank you for coming with me in this journey. Look at this! Well, isn't this lovely? I mean, they did break some of their stuff, but hey, it's okay. It's alright. Place you right here, and we'll place you right here. There we go. Lovely! Small little farms, lots of weed, very good indeed. Uh, we hear a baby villager. <gasps> a growing stand. Shh, you saw nothing. Take that, thank you very much. What are you? Ooh, a baby villager, I know I can't trade with you. What's in here, nothing? A bed? Hello, sir. You're, you're one of them. I forgot their names. They just don't trade or anything. It's an iron golem, lovely. Is that? It's a smoker. I know what smokers do, but I think they're pretty much like furnaces. But way faster, jeez. Oh, you are. You're a farmer. You would take some beetroots for some emeralds and an emerald for some bread. Bread, that's useful. And another bucket, that's also useful. And we have a bunch of grass, that's useless. Um, a little bit sad that we have no beetroots. All right, Oreo, come on. Let's get out of here. Don't need anything from these guys. They have absolutely nothing that's useful for us. <gasps> we found it! I was gonna say that this place is just so freaking empty, but we found it! Oh, yes! Yes! Let's slap you right here, sir. And, um, I'm gonna actually throw you guys away. As well as, uh, maybe the sweet berries. Uh, how many slots do we still have? One, two, three, four. Hmm. I know if we're gonna need more than four. Why do I have... Oh my god. Whatever, whatever. Now we got five. Do you think we can waste these on anything else? Yeah, we can actually make like another axe or something like that. So yeah, we'll see once we get down there. Uh, where's my iron pick? There it is. Hmm? I'm gonna make myself a safe way down there, and a safe way up there. Or actually, I'm just gonna say screw this, and I'm just gonna don't go down like this. There we go. Nice, nice. Okay, so you like this. Down like that. This way down, right? Yep. I still remember. I haven't been into these in so long, but I do still remember. Break you. Yeah. Oh! I was so dumb. I thought I was actually down here. Then I saw this. I was like, hmm, weird, why is the floor not there? <laughs> why is the floor so far away? <laughs> uh, these are not trap chests, are they? No, they're not. 
Okay, gunpowder, useful, as well as iron ingots, that's useful. Some bones, that's useful too. Loyalty, that's absolutely useless, but I'll take you. I actually I'll keep you in there, maybe I'll find something more useful. Mob drops, I don't know about that. I'll take the gunpowder, and um, maybe the rotten flesh, I'll take you. And I'll take, uh, not you, these, and I'll take the golden apple, I'll remove the bones. Another golden apple, more of you, more of you, more of you, no, no, really, is that it? Is that all what we found? I expected some diamonds, or something like that. But no, no, not even diamonds, you're not gonna get that either. Well, th that's a little bit sad, honestly. But hey, it's okay, at least, at least we got some stuff, which are very not good at all, I'm, I'm lying. These are, these are just crap. I already have most of them at, back at my base. Hey, at least we got you some armor. Look at that. Not too shabby. Alright, let's, um... I do want the fence post. So we don't need you. And we do need that one too. Oh, come back here, sir. You're not gonna be leaving without me. I know you really want to go home. Oh, come on. Okay, we can't give you any food. Eh, don't need the arrow, it's only a single arrow. Alright, I'm gonna go back home and hopefully I'll meet you there. If I don't meet you, that you meet you there, that means I absolutely lost my way and you're just gonna hear me crying for the next like 50 hours. Alright people, we're making grounds. I think the house is straight off that way. There's the horses. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just straight that way. If I kept going this way, we're just gonna find the house. There it is! Look at that. We made our way back somehow. I honestly never done this before. This has never worked out with me. Every time I went on a journey, I, that, that's it. I know that, it, that I never come back to my house. That's why I don't usually build houses in Minecraft. Because I know that if I take a journey uh, away from home, I'll never come back. So I just decided not to do any journeys in the first place. But hey, this is my first time that I actually survived a journey back home. She's, it feels very good. I feel accomplished, actually. Lovely stuff. Um, so I think I'm just going to end the episode here. What we did today is we found a village. Lovely stuff. And we also got ourselves a bunch of books. I might actually make myself an enchanting table right now. But for some reason, I do not have obsidian. Ah, oh, yes, I do. And I have more diamonds here? What? That's cool, I didn't know that. I thought that I moved all the items over there. Well, that's cool, I got myself some more diamonds and more obsidian. Now we have five diamonds and 15 emeralds. Wow, that's a lot of emeralds. That is a crap ton of emeralds. Right, there we go, that's an enchanting table. We're gonna place that right up here, I think. Um. So, there has to be one block, one block, then right here. Let me see. We did that. 16! Exactly enough books. We have just enough books. But we need more and more wood. Now, I'm just gonna place all of these right here. This one right here. The ring stand can be right here. And the ground stone can just stand. Actually, no. No, 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 no. That's, uh, that's not acceptable. Come here, boy. I'm gonna place you right here. Boom! Right next to the anvil. We might make a whole building for the anvil, because that would actually look cool. I don't mind that. There we go, that's 10. That's 17. And that's not enough. That would... Lovely stuff. Yes. All right, now we should just place these in the correct way, just like this. Two more, three more, two more, and boom. A full enchanter. And we have so many levels. Efficiency 4, straight out of the bat. Efficiency 4. Give me that lapis. Place you, and place you, and boom, and we got Silk Touch. Ooh, not too shabby, I actually do like that. What else do we have? We have more efficiency, which I might place on this, maybe? I might actually, I might actually, um... Efficiency. Hmm... 
we have enough diamonds for another axe. But I think it would be the best thing to do is to get a pickaxe because we need fortune. Or actually I might just get fortune on this because I don't really care that much. So I'm just going to make myself an axe. A nice lovely little diamond axe right here. And I'm going to go and enchant it. Big efficiency. Efficiency and fortune and unbreaking. Oh. Oh, yes. Oh, I feel powerful. I feel powerful. I love this. Anyway, thank you everyone so much for watching this video. If you liked it, go ahead and so gently click that like button now. But no, do subscribe for more videos just like this one right here. This has been a very nice episode. So we found a village which wasn't useful at all towards us, honestly. Uh, I'm gonna replant these. And uh, next episode, I am gonna go to the nether, probably. I'm gonna die, probably. And then I'm gonna delete my channel. <laughs> There's probably some people ha out there that are happy. They're like, <gasps> finally, thank God, he's gonna delete his dumb, cringy channel. I don't know. I don't know how many of you are actually enjoying whatever I'm putting on the channel. I mean, I hope most of you are. Because I am enjoying like uploading and recording and stuff like that. So yeah, hopefully you are enjoying your time. And uh, if you are, leave a like rating down below and do subscribe for more videos just like this one right here. And I'll see you on the next video and until next time, take care. And by the way, if you have any cool uh, like maps which you want me to play on the channel, I would love to know. Uh, I, do, I did enjoy the, uh, the past few maps which I've had and I do want to play some more of them. So if you have any more maps, that are kind of cool and you think I should play them on the channel. Link them down in the description. I don't know, maybe it's a parkour map. Maybe it's um, it's an adventure map, a custom adventure. I don't know. And maybe even a server that you want me to play on. I don't mind that. Just comment down below. And I'll see you on the next video. Bye!